Just in case y'all don't know what's going on, JP Morgan just decided that they no longer wanted to do business with Yeezy or Ye because of his antics or freedom of speech. PayPal said they're going to start taking $2,500 in fines against anyone that has an account with them um, if they are proven to provide misinformation online. Andrew Tate, if you don't know who he is, look him up. Merchants accounts and banks said they didn't want to do business with him anymore. What are we starting to see? That if you do not align with the way that these banks or institutions think, they have the power to take your money, hold your money, and stop you from doing business anywhere else. To me, that's not banking. That's not securing my assets anymore. That's you trying to act as if that you're a political party or you're controlling the way that you think personally. Which leads me to prove my main point. These banks are nothing but family-run organizations with their own independent thought. They now have the power to control how we manage our money with their institutions. Which is what it's been anyway. Then PayPal turns back around and says, I'm sorry, we didn't mean to put that in our terms and conditions, that we will fine you $2,500 for misinformation at our discretion. What we meant was, we'll charge you $2,500 for discrimination at our will. It's like the same thing, just wordplay. Is we stupid? This is why I tell you all, banks are for transactions only, not for you to hold your money there. I mean, it's clear and evident, right? That's why I like to keep my money inside of insurance reserves, because with the insurance companies, we have a contract that states you got to do right by me and my money. As long as I keep patroning your business the way that the contract states, you have to do what's right by me. So I store all of my surplus cash inside my insurance reserve and I use our banks for transactions. I would suggest that you do it, too. We teach that. You know where to find us. Stop letting these banks play with you.